Right, so for the day's vlog, I'm going to um, head down by the castle and along the beach and that. It's just going to be for wildlife images. The weather's a bit flat, so I'm not actually going to get a good landscape. I very much doubt it. Uh, that and I want to test out the new camera because I've got a GoPro Hero 7 Silver. Um, so it should be better than the new action camera I've got. Just want to try that out. So I shall see you down there. Right, so here I'm on at the castle, uh, as you can see. Right, so I'm going to wait here. I'll get a couple of hopefully the new birds that come in, the goldfinch, the chuff chaff, and um, just take a wait and see. And the other reasons I've been doing this vlog as well is I want to test out this new GoPro because it's, it seems to be better than the, the newer one that I had. Um, certainly the sound's a lot better, but I've not got a mic on it, so I'm waiting on getting the adapter um, to go for USB-C and the, 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 the jacking point thing. So um, hopefully I'll get better sound again because I've got the lav mic, so I don't mind using that. So right now I'm just going to go and get on the hangs and get kit set up and see what turns up. Alright, I'm sitting here in front of that tree that's just right there. Um, and what I'm hoping to get in there is a goldfinch set on that and so there's a wee chaff chaff. Um, so I've got the cameras up and running, I'm on shutter priority. Uh, speed set at 1250th of a second and I've got the exposure compensation set at two stops over as well. Um, to highlight the front of the bird, so it's now it's just a wee waiting game. Hopefully, I'll get some. Um, I mean, once I was setting the camera up, while I was setting the camera up, the goldfinch were there, so but typical for me when I turn around, they're gone. So, right, let's go on that. So, I've been at the castle for an hour and I've got a couple of goldfinch and a couple of seagulls, one flying by the castle, one on the background down at the, the beach sort of thing. Um, I got some young bird as well, I don't know what it is, so I'm going to have to identify that. Um, reasonably chuffed with what I've got, so I'm going to head off down along the beach now and see what I can get along that way. came down onto the beach. Uh, there's nothing here. I've came along the wood line and there's there's none you can hear them but they're not showing so I'm gonna have I'm gonna have to head round towards Dyser Bay. So just as I'm heading round to the after the turret is um had to be noise on the beach look then there's a couple of Easter catchers and then there's another bird I haven't identified it yet. Well, that's it there. You can see that. So I'll identify that when I got the road, but I've got a couple of decent images. Right, so I was walking along that way and back, I came up in and stopped so far around and um, turn you around. There's an island just out there and there's a couple of seals on it, so I've got the images of the seals, I've got a couple of cormorants and that, um, so between that and the oyster catchers that I got, I'm quite happy, so I'm going to call it quits at that. Head up the road, see what I've got image wise, and get them edited and hopefully throw them up. So, see you up there. Right, so the challenges of the day, um, I was dealing with my frustration with people coming in and out of the castle because there were quite a lot of visitors in. Um, it kind of stopped the smaller birds. Um, and the big surprise was actually one man holding his kids back to let me get the photos of the the goldfinch when it was in, which I was completely surprised at because normally we would just let the kids run run about, so that, that was nice, that was a good thing. Um, the frustration the time I went down the beach, the tide was coming in so I couldn't get as close to the seals I wanted, which the image that I got, um, it, it's decent but um, I, it could be better than I know it could. 
but hey, I think other than that, I just enjoyed it. The day I enjoyed being at. Um, it's a nice wee couple of hours just sitting and chilling, I suppose. Uh, yeah, I think that's that. In terms of the GoPro, I'm happier with the, the image quality. I definitely am. Um, compared to the Neva, it's just it's getting strips off it. Uh, the sounds better than the Neva camera as well, but um, you know, the, the, obviously the difference is reflected in the price between the two units. But, but you know, I'm still going to get the mic adapter, um, so they'll be able to use the lav, so get better quality again. So I think that's it. Um, hopefully you've enjoyed the video, you've seen the images or you'll see them at the end now. Um, and if you have enjoyed it, then feel free to like and subscribe and I shall see you the next time. Au revoir.